You've been wasting my time, Beric. It stops now. Seeker, you wound me. The champion nearly starts a war, and you're all too happy to bury it beneath your words. You will tell me about the Kunari. What's left to say? The Arashok was killed and a champion crowned. And yet we had Orlesians threatening sanctions of every kind and measure. What happened at Chateau Haim? What happened with Talis? You've heard about her? We had someone there, but they lacked your access. Whatever Talis was to the champion, it seems like it angered a nation. Thousands of lives were at stake, Seeker. Perhaps one still is. Uh, nicely non-specific. <clears throat> All right, let me set the scene. An ambush, an invitation, a hunting party. All because of Talus. And of course, there's no one. All I know is it had something to do with you and nobles. Edge is usually very reliable. That's what you get for listening to someone named Edge. This is normally when we're ambushed. Why? It's not always an ambush. All right. Maybe sometimes it's an ambush. And there is the champion of Kirkwall. You die today. Oh! Sloppy. You'd think the crows would be better at this. They've been doing it for ages. Were these crows a gift from you? That's generous. Oh, I didn't arrange this, but it's no coincidence I'm here. My name is Talis, and I've been looking for you. Looking for me? Looking for the woman who has an invitation to Chateau Hain, to be specific. Oh, that's what Edge was on about. You remember? Duke Prosper, the one who fawned all over you at the Champion of Kirkwall Banquet. He talked about a hunt. I doubt I'd go to such a thing. I was hoping you'd reconsider. The Duke is a delightful host. Or so I hear. Let me guess, this isn't just a social call? I need to relieve him of something he has no right to possess. And I can't do it alone. You want to rob him? Well, stealing from Orlesians is never wrong, or so I've been told. This isn't how I was planning to ask you this. I was picturing an introduction with less blood. Why not? I hear the Orlesians make excellent cheese. <laughs> That's right. You're Ferelden, aren't you? We're not actually dog people, despite whatever rumors you've heard. I'll keep that in mind. So tell me. 
What exactly is it you want to steal? A jewel. The Duke thinks it's valuable, and it is. Just not in the way he believes. What's more, he shouldn't have it in the first place. He who wishes to walk on water must first learn to swim. Come with me to Chateau Hain. I'll explain everything on the way. If nothing else, you get fine wine and fancy company. But I hope you want more than that. Don't forget to loot the bodies. Do I ever. Village and plunder is half the fun. The jewel we're after is called the Heart of the Many. Interesting name. Interesting jewel. All I care about is getting it away from the Duke. Here's the problem. The heart is in a vault, behind who knows what kind of traps. Protected by a private army of Orlesian Chevaliers. All inside a fortress that was designed to be impregnable. And let's not forget, it's on the side of a mountain, in the middle of nowhere. Surrounded by monsters. And just as dears prosper, when is this going to get started? Presently. All right, everyone. You all know the tradition, yes? The first to find and slay a wyvern wins the honors of the evening. And bragging rights, of course. Good luck to you all. I'm here by invitation. Would you tell your master that I've arrived? Ah! The Champion of Kirkwall. These are honored guests. Please excuse Cahir. <laughs> a polite bodyguard is a contradiction in terms, or so I am told. A chastened? Here? Oh yes, you are Ferelden, aren't you? You would know of his people. They traded in Lothering sometimes. My family never had a problem with them. See that, Cahir? Now you have someone to speak to. He's so very chatty, let me tell you. And who is this lovely specimen? You flatter me, Your Grace. And I see you brought a manservant or two, already armed and armored. Wonderful. I must say, your presence is a surprise. When we spoke at the banquet, you seemed uninterested when I mentioned our hunt. It's a favorite pastime of mine to find things and kill them, actually. <laughs> so I hear. At any rate, I won't keep you from the hunt. Wouldn't want you to fall behind the others, yes? I don't think I've ever encountered a wyvern before. And why would you? There are exceptional beasts, magnificent cousins to the mighty dragon. My only advice, beware their poison. It's the deadliest thing about them, as well as the most valuable. It will be an interesting diversion, I'm sure. Good luck to you, my lady. Remember, fortune favors the bold. You have come a long way to join our Duke, sirrah. You'll pardon me for saying that you do not seem like a hunter. A word of caution, since you are new to this. Wyverns spit venom. Their victims suffer terrible pain before they die. Death is always the result, then. Depending on exposure, it may take days. But yes, death is always the outcome if the poison isn't treated. Since people hunt these creatures successfully, I imagine there's a trick to learn. Ah, oh, there are many tricks. It is best not to face the beasts head on. Flank them. Blind them if you can. I have no doubt this will be a challenge, but I'm sure it's a worthy one. May Andraste keep you safe.
If you fail to avoid the venom completely, there are treatments. A distillation of herbs, equal parts, Drake Vein, Andraste's Mantle, and Winterberry can counteract the poison. May the Maker's luck grace your hunt. Be safe, Syrah. I'm afraid I can't help you. Manservant. Should be elf servant, if you think about it. It's only a cover. I'd like to cover him with six feet. So these are the hunting grounds. I take it we run around randomly shouting, Here, Wyvern, Wyvern, Wyvern! We just need to look for signs and be careful. If we get this over with, we get into the keep. And that's where the jewel is. That's where the jewel is. Have you seen a pair of corsairs? I've been calling and calling, but it is no use. Nicodemus should know better. But Sylvain never had an ounce of sense in his head. Slow down and tell me what happened. My hounds have disappeared. They took off after a stag. And the Maker only knows where they've gotten to now. Please, you must help me find them. If I see your dogs, I'll let you know. May Andraste guide you. I've good coin for anyone who finds my dogs. A lot of blood. Would that be prey or from a wyvern itself? I've heard they fight for dominance. Can't be gentle. Maybe we can use some to draw out rivals. You called? I notice you don't have a nickname for me. I call you Hawk. You've probably heard it once or twice. But that's my name. It's not like Daisy or Blondie. Well, all right, Waffles. You really want a nickname? I can hook you up. Waffles? <laughs> that's unexpected. Not our prey, I suspect. Do dragons and wyverns even mix? I don't think so. So if we drop part of this in the right spot, we might lure a wyvern out to protect its territory. Good thought. Do that. Add it to what we have already. Is it enough to draw one out of hiding? I'd say so. A little one. Probably all we need. In the right spot, no doubt. Hunting for sport. Is it wrong of me to cheer for the wyverns? Just ignore them. <laughs> Hey, do we 
really wish to draw such a creature to us? You'd think one of them had ever been on a hunt before. I think we found something. We can head to the base. After it! There is something in there. A nest, perhaps. name with those ghasts cave creatures they don't come out on the surface much however hungry for hunters perhaps Oh, blessed Andraste, thank you. I thought I'd die out here. I've been trapped here since last night. Were you injured? Why were you out here? The gas that chased me here got a few scratches in. But I'll heal. The truth told, I'm not looking for the women. I'm a scholar from Cumberland, researching an Avar cult that once lived here. They worship the Lady of the Skies to the exclusion of all other gods. I'm searching for their shrine. I've seen something that might be the shrine you're looking for. Then you have succeeded where I failed. The rumors say they were driven from their last refuge. They left a great treasure in the goddess's keeping. <sighs> but the mountain has defeated me. Please, take my research and see if you can do anything with it. I will try to make it back to camp. Good luck to you, Sarah. Do we expect to find this thing? Do we even want to? The sooner we get the hunt over with, the sooner we'll be at the Chateau to finish this. Just how long has this living hunt been going on? The more efficient, the more Four began to keep the population down. They breed quickly. Elves, too. We're plucky that way. Well, there's no annual elf hunt. Yet. And the Orlesian nobility is only too happy to help out. 
It's a game. The Molfars are so close to the Empress, so anything that pleases them is worth pursuing. Plus, you should really try the Aquai Lucidius. You'll be seeing purple dragons in the sky for days. Forty crowns a bottle on the black market. Not that I've checked or anything. I'm no hunter, but I'll wager that's a sign. There you go, Hawk. It seems we're on the trail. Too bad the trail isn't upwind. Pretty countryside, at least. The Molfor family inherited this mountain from a clan of Navarran dragon hunters. Well, maybe inherited is the wrong word. What do you call it when you kill someone in order to get all their stuff? Murder? Profitable murder, maybe. Look, I think he wants us to follow him. Watch it. Gas hole. A what hole? A little scholar might be something else. But they don't know the gas from a hole in the ground. Nest can often be a hundred or more. Just be thankful we're not underground. Oh no, poor thing. Wyvern poison, I'm almost certain. Poor thing. We'll have to leave him here. We could tell his owner where he is. I don't know that it'll help much, though. We're getting closer. Another one. Oh, well, at least we're getting... <sighs> Looking for clues. Ah, until you wash that off, Hawk, I'm going to stay upwind. Ooh, nug bones. I wonder if a nug call would help attract a wyvern. You know a nug call? You go elbow deep in wyvern shit, and I'm the weird one?
you were too willing to involve yourself in the affairs of others, Hawk. Each time you put yourself at risk, one day you will not be so lucky. You have a better idea? Guard what you have, keep your head low. That sounds like a way to go through life without ever knowing anyone. I suppose so. How well has that worked for you?